you know, to take a song like Iron Man by Black Sabbath and put it into a the context of acoustic piano, bass, and drums is, you know, it's, it's a bit off the wall, I suppose, but at the same time, when we play it, we're playing it with the intention of, you know, engaging the audience in a very complicated way. We went to the same junior high school. We're from a suburb of Minneapolis called Golden Valley, and, and you know we were just young musicians that you know you, you find each other, and, and we hit it off immediately. We we had the same musical interests, and, and we started playing together basically immediately after we, we met each other. We were naturally bent kind of personalities, always searching, not really caring about what was cool or not. I always wanted to make music that I'd never heard before. I, that's been a goal of mine since I was an early teenager. And the minute I played with Reed and Dave, and it was like, wow, that actually I don't think I know what this really sounds like. I mean, I don't really have a reference. Reed and Dave are two of my most important teachers. Uh, we don't come from exactly the same spaces artistically, like wherever the real center of it is. I think they're in slightly different places and that's important for this, this threesome to get along in, in some way. You know, if we were really all on the same page, yeah, I don't know if it would work as well. It's the sound of getting together in your garage and all committing no matter what and, you know, seeing what you can make up today. This band contains some of the most punk energy I've ever seen or felt as a musician. It just doesn't need to do it so obviously. And we're really interested in that. That's our statement, is that it's complex emotion.